Hey guys, welcome to another baseball card break with Matt. We picked up a baseball 2021 series one from Tops. This concludes seven packs and one 70th anniversary patch card, guys. Opened one of these up the other day on this channel and found some decent stuff. Nothing too great, no autographs or game used relics or anything like that. But the patch cards are pretty cool. Depends on who you get, really. You can see right here, here is like the checklist of who all you can get. I just pulled a Chiro. So that was 70 LPI Chiro right there. So that's pretty cool. Let me show you guys the odds out there. I know you guys like to see those odds. So go ahead and pause your screen and check out those odds right there. And there is your no purchase necessary right there, guys. All right, so we're going to jump into it. We're going to save any of the rookies that we find. Hopefully, we'll get some hits in this, but who knows. So let's go ahead and open up the box. I want to give a shout out to my favorite local card shopper down the street here called 10th Inning Sports and Collectibles, guys. They are located in Inman, South Carolina. They are awesome. They made sure that they saved Matt here some of these. They knew Matt was coming through. They were like, we saved you some, bro. We know you're coming through. So let's go ahead and open it up. There is our packs inside, guys. Let's jump in and see. If we're going to get anything cool, and it does come with a nice $10 in savings coupon book, guys. I'll just give you a quick glance at some of these right here. Just a lot of different stuff, as you can see. Alrighty, so we'll save our patch card for last right there, guys. And go ahead and start going through these packs. And then near the end of the video, I will pause it, and I'm going to go through all these real fast to make sure we don't have any short print cards that we might have missed. Because even though it's a numbered card, I found doesn't mean it's necessarily a short print. Like, yeah, it might be out of 300, but it's still like part of the normal set card, guys. So let's go ahead and jump start this with Shane Bieber. We got their mask on with hands up with Mookie Betts celebrating. That's pretty cool with Cody Bellinger. That's an awesome card right there, guys. We got Manny Machado, Juan Soto. We've got Freddie Freeman. We've got ourselves a Rafael Devers, Marcel Ozuna, Sonny Gray. We got Christian Yelich insert. Pretty cool. We got Ronald Guzman, Yadier Molina, we've got Ra Hoskins, and we got Aaron Judge. So good old Aaron Judge right there, guys. All right, so nothing really good in that first pack. Like not even one single rookie. All right, looky, not one single rookie. All right, so here we go. Started off in the second pack. We got a Detroit Tigers team card, guys. That's pretty cool. We got ourselves Josh Harrison. Nice card. That's an awesome looking card. We got Jose Urena. We got Ian Anderson rookie card. Finally, we pulled a rookie. We got David Dahl. We've got a Buck Farmer. We got Aristas Aquino Future Stars card, guys. That's pretty cool. I'm going to stick that to the side for my PC. We got Jose Urenity. Josh Donaldson insert throwback card. We got Raphael Devers insert. We have ourselves a hey, Marin Gonzalez. Brandon Woodruff. Here's a Cody Whiteley wiki card. That's pretty cool. And Mike Yaskrimski. Already got that card in my collection already. Opened up one of these on another video, guys, not too long ago. And I'm starting to get some repeats already. And that sucks when you're trying to build up your sets. All right. But if they want to give me like a Mike Trout one of one autograph or something in here, that, that would totally make up for it, right? We got Oliver Perez, Wade LeBlanc. We got a Sandy Slam Diego, four games, four slams card. That's pretty cool right there, guys. I like that. We got Trevor Williams, Hunter Renfro. We got a rookie card for Daniel Johnson. Let's take his rookie to the side. Dalton Varsho rookie card. Got another rookie of Santiago Espinal. Another rookie card. Isaac Paredes. That's nice. Pete Alonzo. Good old Pete. 
Got another rookie of Jesus Sanchez. Man, this is like this was just the rookie pack. Patrick Corbin, Tony Kemp, and Jay Bruce. And like I said, guys, we'll go back through these near the end of the video real fast. That way I can see if we missed any short print cards. They're saying the short print variations is like a base card. Let's see. A base card has got the code at the end and at the bottom down there at. Let's see if I can get it to focus. 313. You see that? Or 213. Excuse me. So 213 tells you that that's just a base common card. You know, nothing special about that guys but if you find it with the code ends down there in 230 231 and 232 i believe that is going to tell you that it is a short print a super short print and then a ultra short print so let's keep going through these guys like i said we will go through them we got griffin cannon miami marlins team card that's pretty cool all right we've got ourselves a jake arietta Rookie card for Christian Pache. Nice. We're definitely going to stick that to the side. We got Miguel Cabrera, Adam Plutko, Gio Gonzalez, Ruffin Odar. This is pretty cool. This is like a different parallel, if you want to call it that, of the card. It's got like the royal blue, like it said, to look, be on the lookout for those royal blues. So I'll stick that with the cool finds of the of the decks we got Mike Piazza throwback wow I actually have this card in my PC Casey Miz rookie card Eric Sorgard Malik Smith with his mask on we got Brandon Crawford and Chris Paddock all right three more packs to go I already got a nice little pile of rookies going that's pretty cool we got AJ Pollock we got ourselves a Dane Dunnan rookie card, Mitch White rookie card, Future Stars, Trent Grisham. Let's stick that to the side. We like Trent Iguaro Rodriguez. We got ourselves a Wilson Contreras, Mike Trout. I already pulled this in my last video. We got Mitch Moreland. All right, guys, we got something. We have a numbered out of 50. 7 out of 50, this is going to be Dane Dunnan, rookie card, guys. So, Dane Dunnan, we just pulled his regular card like two seconds ago. Check it out. So, there's the regular card, and here is a numbered one, guys. So, that's pretty, I like that. That's pretty cool, out of 50. So, we'll stick that with our cool finds. That's awesome. We got Freddie Freeman. We got Steven Matz. Mark Cahana, Willie Calhoun, and we have Salvador Perez. All right, so that was pretty cool. I always like finding numbered cards, guys, just to be like, hey, I got, you know, a card that's only 50 of them made. And you know, I mean, collectors are out there now, guys. There's millions of us. There's no longer just a couple hundred thousand at the conventions. Like, you'd have to travel from eight different states to meet up in one place no there's a convention around every corner now we got dansby swanson we got justice sheffield caven biggio baltimore orioles team card texas rangers team card we got a league leaders of shane bieber it's pretty cool little insert there we got a Matthew Boyd. We got a Luke Voigt. A throwback Yankees of Garrett Cole. Joey Votto. We got Albert Almar Jr. That's a pretty cool card. Julio Urias. We have Max Kepler. And a Luke Voigt. All right, so the last pack of the regular packs, and then we will open our patch card, guys. Let me know down in the comments, have you had any luck pulling anything out of the Series 1 so far? I know they just hit the market, but trust me, people are already buying them up like crazy. They're not necessarily opening them, though. They are hoping that people will pay their ridiculous scalping fees. We got Joey Wendell. We got a Mets star card of uh, Stars Celebrate. Get up, Mets. 
We got Humberto Mija. This is his rookie card. Nick Nerder rookie card. We got Josh Reddick. Future stars of Blue Star Guard Terrell. That's nice. I stuck that with the futures. Andres Gimenez. Here we go. Is our other Royal Blue insert, guys. This is Wilmer Flores. Not numbered or anything like that. We have a Alex Bregman home run challenge card guys that's awesome if you don't know what these are you basically go to the website scratch off the code and then you pick a date of a game that that player will be playing in and if that person hits a home run basically you're going to win a grand prize to the home run derby of 2022 so that's pretty cool i will stick that to the side and enter my chances to win that would be awesome to go to that Glaber torres here we go, we got Johnny Cuto, Clayton Kershaw, Max Mutzi, and a Zach Brighton, guys. So, let's go ahead and open up our commemorative patch card, guys. And these aren't really that valuable. Yeah, they're cool and all, but it depends on who you get, really. So, here we go. I already have a Chiro. We have Johnny Bench. Good old Johnny Bench. Commemorative 70th anniversary cards. You can see what it says on the back right there. Congratulations. So I will add that with my Ichiro. So that's pretty cool to check that off the list. So guys, I will be right back. I'm going to scan through these cards real quick to see if we have any short prints or anything like that. And then we'll be back for review. Alright guys, we are back. We have went through the entire stack of cards. Didn't find any short prints or anything like that in that stack. So the best cards, let's count them down that we found. Let's just start with this. We found a nice stack of just basic rookie cards right here, guys. Nothing too hot in there, but we'll see. We don't know yet because the season hasn't really started yet. So we're going to see if any of these guys are going to be any good. Of course, we will sleeve these and top load all our rookie cards that we find. Let's just go ahead and count down some. We've got this right here. Future Stars of Gr Trent Grisham. That's a pretty cool card, guys. I like that. we got a Parallel Royal Blue card of Ruffin Odar. We've got a Home Run Challenge card with Alex Bregman as our hitter. So let's just hope good old Alex Bregman can hit the ball over the fence on whatever game day I choose. Then we got our cool little Johnny Bench commemorative patch card right there. But the best pull of the night is going to have to be this Dane Dunning numbered out of 57 out of 50, guys. Only 50 people in the world out of all of us collectors will have that card. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Be sure to hit that like button down below and let me know down in the comments what was your favorite card of the night and if you've had any luck pulling anything from this series yet. Hope you guys have a wonderful week. Don't forget to subscribe. Peace.